All right, Jacob's gonna go first try. Try and hit this can up here. Hit the top can, Jacob. Oh, we're gonna hit the volleyball instead. Amy, me, and you—we have to go do some shopping. We gotta send her something special. First try, no scope. Dude, you're not even aiming at it. Why don't you go with scope? dudes out there we are about to have an amazing day that you're not gonna see much of <laughs> we are gonna be doing a lot of traveling today I told you yesterday Amy is going to be going to her sister's uh, uh, bright what, what is it called is it called a bachelorette party thing whatever you call that and me and the boys are fixing to drive to Arkansas we are just now getting out on the road uh, we got about five and a half hours of driving ahead of us it's gonna be so fun are you boys ready you excited yeah. <laughs> not for the drive but you're excited to see granny right yeah all right, let's do this. So we made it to the hotel. Woohoo! It's time for a bachelorette party. George is super excited, right? Super excited. <laughs> so I'm going to give you guys a quick room tour before we head down to the pool. So when you walk in, you have this nice bathroom on the right. Has the usual toilet, sink, shower behind the store. Then there's like a little small kitchen area. And then you have two beds. Pretty typical for a hotel. And our view kind of sucks. All we see is the parking lot. There it is. Golden Corral. This is where Xander loves to eat. And he asked his mommy last night if we could have it, right? Yeah. And what'd she say? She said, nope, you better not get it. So we're stopping and getting it. Here's Jacob's lunch. Is that good? Here's Xander's lunch as he stuffs his face. And here's mine. Actually, I'm just kidding. We already ate lunch. We forgot to video it, but we did get all the desserts. Figured that was the important part, right? Now we got rain. Man. Right as we're getting to my mom's place, it's starting to pour down rain in here. Guess what? We've made it to Granny's neighborhood. It's really not a neighborhood, but this is what the boys consider Granny's neighborhood. When we get down this long road going out into the uh, into the wilderness. What are you hitting? The ball? Yeah. Why not the can? Oh, Dude, I hit the can on my first try. Nah. They call me dead shot. Ah, oh, off to the side of it. It was the right height that time. Oh, that was like three inches off to the side, you know dude. Bam! Oh. Got it! Good shot, dude. First try, no scope. Dude, you're not even aiming at it. Why don't you go with scope? All right, Jacob's up now. Whoa. Oh, you're going for that can. Okay. <laughs> We've been going for a different can. I see the one you're going for now. Ooh, I was right below it, dude. So I'm up here on my mom and dad's property, and uh, we just got through eating some dinner. And now the boys are out with Aunt Kaylee walking around looking for Pokemon, I think. Maybe they're over there. See if they can find some Pokemon. I caught like three. You've caught like three? Yeah. See, there's a lot of Pokemon out here. You were worried there wasn't going to be any. There's only three Rattatats. Oh, there's Rattatats? That's what, been what, pretty common. There's a, crab, there's a crabby nearby. Why don't you walk out like by the fence line and stuff too? Yeah. I win. So all this property out here. All the way down the dirt road. Way out over there. All the way around out over here. and. Back in the fence line, back out there. So all this property is my parents. Uh, someday it'll be uh, passed on to probably Kaylee because it's pretty far out here. <clears throat> and I think that uh, it would be best if it was left to Kaylee. That's, that's that's what I think personally. My sister, I just found out today because like she's been homeschooled for as long as I can remember. She's graduated now. I did not know that. Now when I get back home, 
Amy, me and you, we have to go do some shopping. We gotta send her something special because she took the time. To, I mean, yeah, it's people. Some people like they they say things about people that are homeschooled or whatever. I was homeschooled and I turned out just fine. Kaylee's been homeschooled. She's gonna turn out just fine. Um, so it's that's a that's a good accomplishment. I'm very proud of you, Kaylee. If you ever watch this video, you don't understand how proud I am. I'm very proud of you. Uh, can't wait to see what you do with your life. I know she says she wants to be a, a nurse of some sort. She's not quite sure what nursing field, but she wants to do nursing, and she has yet to ever have a, have a, her first job though and she's 18 so she's gonna have a weird uh weird experience coming up soon did you find any out there uh, so you gotta keep looking until you well, find him like no nah, he wouldn't be that far away from you guys hey congratulations for uh, graduating thank you uh -huh. I'm a, I didn't even know, have any clue that you graduated. I thought it was like this next year that you were going to be graduating sometime. I didn't know you were completely done. Yeah, I'm done. Proud of you. No more school. Thank you. Yeah. Can't wait to see what you do with the rest of your life now. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'm waiting for it to begin. <laughs> <laughs> so I showed you guys the inside of our hotel, but now I want to show you guys the outside. This hotel is amazing. On this side of the hotel, you have this nice big pond and fountain. And then there's a golf course over there. I'm actually see some golfers out there right now, even though it's really, really hot. This is one of the pool areas. It's a huge pool, big water slides back behind there. Here is another pool area, another pretty big pool, a nice water fountain over there. Here is the Lazy River. This is what we stayed in pretty much most of the day yesterday. Pretty awesome. They're still out here. This is like 30 minutes later. They're still walking around looking for Pokemon. And we're leaving my parents' property now. Time to head back to the good old city of Houston. Hello. See you soon, home. All right, so like I was saying, back on the road again. We are headed back home. Uh, had a pretty good visit with my parents and my sister. Uh, we stayed for about six hours, hung out. The boys played with uh, their Aunt Kaylee for a while. I had some good conversations with my mom. Um, for those of you that don't know and haven't been following our vlogs very long, my parents don't really like to be on the vlogs, so that's why I don't pull out the camera when I'm visiting with them. Um, and also, my mom is basically disabled. She's unable to uh, get out of the house unless she's like got a lot of help, and she has to get out once a month to go to a pain management doctor because she is uh, relegated to basically being in the bed 24 7. pretty much she's relegated to being in her bed all the time and, and the only time she really gets up is maybe to go to the restroom or to really that's about it is to go to the restroom it's it's a pretty tough life she broke her back before jacob was born and when, in a few years later like long story short uh the doctors that did the surgery the doctor that did the surgery messed up on her twice and basically now she's uh stuck with being locked in her house basically it, it kind of stinks it's a tough life because she's always on pain medicine as well she has to have pain medicine constantly otherwise she's in too much pain it's just hard for her to deal with anything she has osteoporosis really bad so they can't go back in there and really do anything to refix it so no doctors want to do any surgeries on her she's kind of scared to do any surgeries as well so she just has to deal with the pain but that's that's basically why i don't show my mom on video because she'd prefer not to and i and i respect her wishes you guys, did you guys have a good visit with, with Granny, Papa, and Aunt Kaylee? Yeah? Awesome. Now we're going to head home. And, uh, the drive is too long. The drive is very long. It's like a six hour drive, guys. And now we're headed back home. Hey guys, it's happening. Can you feel it? Do you feel it? You should feel it. Because right about now, we're passing back in to the good state of Texas, baby! Woo! Ah, I feel like I'm home already. 